Well, just like a turkey trot or a warm piece of pumpkin pie, for many, shopping on Black Friday is a holiday tradition. But the National Park Service says that quiet day after Thanksgiving could be green and not black. ABC's chief climate correspondent, Ginger Z, explains what they have in mind. Ah, the day after Thanksgiving. It's been marketed as the biggest shopping day of the year. But now you know those deals go all week, really all month. And consumption is encouraged at every corner. But what if this year you traded in Black Friday for something green? Green Friday is about skipping the shopping, saving your money, and spending the day at one of more than 400 national parks. These are America's treasures, and what a better opportunity than to spend a special holiday weekend when you do have time to spend with your family and friends, to instead of you know sitting in front of a television or going out into a really busy shopping mall and um, just making it more about connection. Environmental Protection Agency metrics from 2016 showed that household waste can increase by up to 25% between Thanksgiving and New Year's, and our holiday season consumption has only increased since then. Spending time outside can not only help the planet, but it also has mental and physical health benefits. If you spend Thanksgiving and you eat all day, I know I do, and then you're getting outside the next day and you're getting those steps in, you're working on your fitness, but also on your mental health, and then just getting to disconnect from devices, hopefully, and really be and experience the moment with you and your loved one. Um, whatever your family looks like. And if you're looking for a national park to spend Green Friday, there may be one right near your home. You can go to the National Park Service website or download the app to find parks and events nearby for your own Green Friday celebration. With this Climate Minute, I'm Ginger Z. And for us here in the Inland Northwest, the closest national parks are the Roosevelt National Recreation Area and Glacier National Park in Montana. But we have several state parks in our area, including Riverside State Park and Mount Spokane.